France's external intelligence agency spies on the French public's phone calls, text messages, emails, and social media activity in France and abroad, according to the newspaper Le Monde. The paper said that the data is then stored for years in a surveillance program remarkably similar to the activities carried out by the U.S. National Security Agency. What is new is that um, the DGSU uh, collects a lot of data and metadata and gives a lot of those data to other secret intelligence uh, French services, to seven or eight other intelligence services. And that's new because we knew that DGSU um, uh, monitored communications, but we don't know at which scale. Uh, uh, this surveillance uh, goes. Uh, but we didn't know uh, until yesterday that it was the agency that provide other intelligence services uh, all they need. And uh, it can be political, it can be economical, it can be uh, terrorism related uh, stuff. So that's new. Documents leaked by former NSA contractor turned whistleblower Edward Snowden revealed the clandestine organization had access to vast amounts of internet data such as emails, chat rooms, and video from large companies such as Facebook and Google under a program known as PRISM. Earlier this week, French President Francois Hollande said of the U.S. spying program, we cannot accept this kind of behavior between partners and allies. Given this latest development, Hollande is now likely to be more diplomatic with his language. Le Mans report comes amid a storm over media allegations that Washington regularly spies on European citizens and embassies. The allegations made in the German magazine Der Spiegel upset European governments just as transatlantic free trade talks are due to begin.